going to briefly explain that gauges is a form of measuring instrument in which stakers of wind and the lock pairs of your shoes in between 30 to 728 days can vote on the distribution of allocated incentives to the different liquidity pools on the platform as well as user weighted voting power to choose which validators will be receiving the most distributed tokens from the LSDs. The liquid staking derivatives that currently hold around 64,000 Juno that has been bonded for users who receive yields and also has the ability to now join the wide Juno Juno LP pool to earn future rewards. Turn into it, huh? Let's pick wind incentives first. Currently, there are 231k wind rewards per epoch that are distributed to the various pools. And you can vote every epoch of around 7 days. Think I'll choose the post-human validator. This week I uh, think I'll distribute 40% of my voting power. Voting power a little bit evenly on the different projects and LP pools. Let's choose a few others. How about them do? 10%. Allocated 50. a little bit of Juno as you see. Not a lot, but I have it in the wallet. Let's see if this goes through. So in essence, transaction success. There you have it folks. That's how you vote for wind incentives for Windex. Hope this was of any help to you. LSD validator sets. Gages. As you see, the E pops off at around 28 days. So let's pick our validators then. Menu. You can either search. of the different validators and the percentage of votes they've gotten. Thank you.
soon. If you go over the 100% ratio, it will issue a problem that it's not possible. As you see here, you can't work with more than 100% of your total voting power. Yes, we'll just submit our vote. Cost a bit of due now. Perform the transaction. That's it. Transaction success. There you have it, folks.